You know I'll stay here till I talk to you, so you may as well open the door. What the fuck? Where'd you go? For fuck's sake, you fucking brought me there. You knew I didn't know anyone, but along I go, like probably every other dumb bitch you've ever brought anywhere. <laughs> well, I won't be that dumb bitch anymore. I don't believe this. You can't even talk to me. You know, I'm not even that angry. I think I feel sorry for you. Do you believe that? Hello? Bill, oh, thank God. Can you come over? I need to meet my Ruby for an hour or two. I can't find anybody else. Will you really be helping me out? Yeah, okay. I'll see you soon. Okay, bye. See you soon. looking after anyway. She's pretty quiet most of the time. Anyway, it'll be good for both of you to spend some time together. Finally. Shit, I'm late. Bye, Ruby. I'm leaving now. Be back soon. Thanks again. Any problems, you have my number. Bye. my two lads. How'd you get on? Still alive? Yeah. <laughs> nice to see you too. I'm gonna make a cup of tea if you want some, Bill. Bill. Tea? How'd you get on? Any problems? I'm good, yeah. She's a good girl. Yeah. I think she looks after me more than I look after her sometimes. Please, you know I'm no good at this stuff. I'm sorry, it's just... I worry about her, you know? What are you talking about? Um, I had an appointment at the doctor there. Oh, it's okay, I got the all clear, but... It made me think. That's never good. 
You're right, you know, you are no good at this. God, I used to hope you'd wise up. You're too old, Bill. Too old to live how you live. I mean, you're not a teenager anymore. You need some direction. I tried to help you, but... I realize now I don't know you at all. I forgot how frustrating you are. And yet here I am. Don't remind me. Why is it always you? Why can't it be someone else? Someone who cares. Anyway, um, I started thinking today, when I was at the doctor's. What happens to Ruby if I do get sick? Who's gonna look after her? I thought once maybe you would... Maybe you would come around? For a visit, you know? I'm always here. We are family, whether you like it or not. But, uh, I couldn't force you. You have to want to come. I'm lonely, Bill. I haven't even been on a date in, like, two years. And Ruby, she needs someone... She needs someone more. Sylvia, you know I'm no good at this stuff. I can hardly look after myself. You'll be fine. You're so good together. You've got her and she's got you. Just take tonight, for instance. You'll have dinner together. Maybe watch some TV. And you'll tuck her in and kiss her goodnight. You'll feel pretty good then. It's a pretty good existence, if you ask me. But what about you? You could have all this too, you know. I'll be fine. I've tried. And I know my limits. You're so... Frustrating. You're worth so much more than you think you are. I know exactly what I'm worth. And I'm under no illusions. Look, I've enough. I just want to go. But why do you need to get your tea? It's all right. I just want to go now. Hang on there a second. Ruby, do this. I think she'd like you to have it. Thanks again for today. You're a massive help. Thanks for this. I'll see you later. <laughs>